Welcome to Read in Minutes. Here's a short summary of the book, The Bell Jar, by Sylvia Plath. If you enjoy it, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Now let's get started. The Bell Jar is a novel written by Sylvia Plath that tells the story of Esther Greenwood, a young woman who struggles with mental illness and societal pressures in the 1950s. The book is often considered semi-autobiographical, reflecting Plath's own experiences with depression and institutionalization. The story begins with Esther Greenwood, a talented and ambitious college student, winning an internship at a prestigious magazine in New York City. However, instead of feeling excited about the opportunity, Esther begins to feel overwhelmed by the expectations placed upon her. She finds herself struggling with feelings of emptiness and disillusionment, unable to find meaning or fulfillment in her life. As Esther navigates her internship and the pressures of being a young woman in the 1950s, she experiences a series of breakdowns and depressive episodes. She becomes increasingly detached from those around her, including her friends and family, and begins to question her own identity and purpose. One of the central themes of the book is the pressure society places on women to conform to certain expectations and roles. Esther feels trapped by these expectations, struggling to find her own voice and identity amidst the pressures to be a perfect daughter, student, and woman. As Esther's mental health deteriorates, she becomes increasingly suicidal and is eventually hospitalized. She undergoes electroconvulsive therapy, ECT, and struggles to come to terms with her illness and the stigma attached to it. Throughout the novel, Plath uses vivid and often surreal imagery to convey Esther's inner turmoil and descent into madness. The bell jar of the title serves as a metaphor for Esther's mental illness, trapping her in a suffocating and isolating world from which she struggles to escape. Despite its dark subject matter, the bell jar also contains moments of dark humor and irony as Esther grapples with the absurdity of her situation and the hypocrisy of the society around her. In the end, Esther is able to begin her journey towards recovery, but the novel ends ambiguously, leaving the reader uncertain about her future. The Bell Jar is a powerful and haunting exploration of mental illness, identity, and the pressures faced by women in mid-20th century America.